<laughs> Literally, like, we're already speeding. Right? <laughs> By the time we got there, I think it was like a little bit after six. So the office was closed, and then the, like the firewood was closed too. So that's fine. We were able to get some ice because that's like an automated thing. And then they have like a little free library. Uh, you wrote a little book called uh, Jurassic Park. So we got to the site, it was about a mile walk. I think it takes us 30 minutes. Yeah, by the time we got to the campsite it was like just starting to be sunset it was just starting to be so beautiful and then i kind of ended up having to set up the tent in the dark because i just was just so enamored by the beauty of the sunset kind of windy which is a little bit annoying but then it did end up dying down by the time we were eating What do you got? Something you should have. Come here. Did you eat it? Well, if you can't crunch it up, then maybe it's not edible. All right, well, do you. You're naughty. I could have dropped a piece of bread. Okay, it could have been bread too. It didn't seem crunchy. So yeah, the soup that he made, like the soup was good, but the pasta or like the ramen noodles, they were terrible. Like I would basically call it inedible. <laughs> The moon it was like super low, crescent moon, kind of red, and then it disappeared. Next morning, I woke up. He had just like noped out of the whole situation. I think she likes camping, but like also she likes her sleep. Okay, we're sleeping in the woods. Me and little Spooty. Aaron left us last or in the morning. I went to work. <sighs> Beautiful. 
It was an absolutely gorgeous day. It started off like a little bit chilly and I only brought that one sweater um, that my mom had gotten for me for Christmas last year. It has like a pocket for Eha to sit in it. It's, it's funny, but it honestly does come in handy. It was perfect for camping. Good girl, you want another cookie? Thursday. We're out in the middle of nowhere. Kidding. We're at Buckhorn State Campground. And it's just me and little booty. Aaron got up early and went to work. I got up early today too. We're hanging out at the campground. Aaron's gonna come back later. Uh, maybe... He said he could make it back before like six and then he's gonna cook me some dinner. We already laid out in the sun for a while. I saw an eagle. I saw a woodpecker. Beautiful. We're gonna go pick some raspberries. I guess I did it. It was a beautiful fire. I started my fire. And now, I looked up what wild grapes look like. And I'm gonna go see if these are them. Okay, here we go. Yeah, okay, so they said if the leaves have a lot of pokies on them, then it's good, and they do. I'm leaving. 
let's go. You're a good girl. Oh, I saw this huge frog on the beach. I've never seen a frog so big, like so up close, and like the green was so vivid. It freaked me out. Can you tell me you love him? Ah! <laughs> you scared? You want to come over here? I'm and then yeah, we walked up the beach. We enjoyed another sunset. Aaron came back probably a little bit after I was done picking berries again. That's what caught my eye, really. Yeah, uh, that was it. Happy end of summer.